Hello, aka Soggy Buns here. Today I want to show you what I did for about $25. It's a mini aquaponics system. And the great thing about this is you can find pretty much any of the, any of the things you need for this setup at Walmart. So let me let me uh, go through and explain to you what it is a little bit and how it works. So here's the actual fish tank and I got that for about eight dollars at Walmart. It's one gallon. Uh, inside I have three feeder fish so they're about 28 cents and I bought them just to cycle the tank just in case I want to buy some guppies or something uh, for aquaponics. Uh, so th the fish tank was probably about eight bucks the water pump was about five dollars, gravel like a dollar or two, fish twenty eight cents a piece, two dollars for the plant, and maybe another three dollars for that pot. So really you could do this setup for twenty dollars. Um, the way that it works is I'm using an air lift system to lift the water up to the plant. And the way that the air lift system works is there's a little ho hole inside that hose right there and what happens is uh, the air lifts up the water to the hose which goes into the plant and feeds the plant and the great thing about aquaponics is the bacteria or the nutrients that the fish leave off from their uh, waste nurses the plants and actually uh, the tanks a little uh, yellow right now so I don't know if I have too many fish or what's going on, but it actually is a lot cleaner than it was now that I added this plant. I bought this plant for about $2 from Walmart, and it has a little bit of scars on it. You should have seen that when I got it from Walmart, but it's actually doing a lot better, the plant is. So I know that the plant's getting enough food and enough water, I believe, from the airlift system. So what I did is I got this pot, and I drilled a little hole in the bottom of it. If you see... I have this little hose that's draining the water that comes up from the air lift system. And so uh, I figured that it would just be a constant enough flow that the pot won't flood and that the plant will still get enough water. And I was also concerned about doing the air lift system about if the water would be oxygenated enough. But if you look, uh, bubbles come from the drain hose and there are also bubbles that come from the air lift when the water replaces the uh, the air inside the hose. So it's actually working very good. But this would be a very easy uh, do-it-yourself uh, mini aquaponic system for your house using an air lift, air lift uh, system. If you have any questions just please leave in the comments and I will try to post some more videos on later on how the plants doing and I might uh, try to use like a tomato plant or some lettuce or cabbage or something like that. Uh, I'm just using uh, the gravel, the extra gravel I had for the bottom of the plant and some bigger rocks just to give the plants some structure. I know that you're supposed to use the, high, the clay, that you get better results with the clay, but this is all I had. And I was on a low budget, so I tried to make it under $20. Oh yeah, also the reason why it was $25 is because I bought this lamp. And I also know that that would be better if it was, uh, the light was coming this way instead of this way. but. Also, you know, just low resources. But easy way to sustain your home. Uh, I hope that this uh, works out good. I did this one so that I could prove to my wife that I'd be able to do, do a larger system. But it actually it doesn't look that bad in our home. So that's, that's it. $20 mini aquaponics system.